Hey guys, I'm the Illusionist and today I'm going to show you one of the simplest mind reading magic tricks ever. Sorry there wasn't any video earlier, but I come back from school pretty late and it's night time so the light is crap. So that's why I'm doing this video a bit late. So yeah, let's get started. So first you can ask the spectator to shuffle the cards as much as they want. As I don't have a spectator, I shuffle the cards but it's normal shuffle, don't worry. So when they're ready, um, ask them to pick a card. Let's say they want this one. So um, yeah, you can, you guys can just look at it. You see it? Okay, that's great. I'm going to put it on top of the deck and shuffle. And now what I'm going to do, I have no idea what your card is, I didn't see it. I'm going to put the cards like that, I'm just run through them, like that. And, and imagine this is the dictator's hand and I'm going to use it to find his card. So, you know, I feel, it feels like it's somewhere around here. Um... Which one will it be? Oh, wait, 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 it's here. The, the finger is guiding me. I think it's this one. The two of clubs? Yes, it was the two of clubs. Isn't it amazing? I'll be right back for the explanation. So first of all, I just want to say, last time I made the video on a self-working magic trick, I asked you guys to comment to tell me if you liked those or not, and I didn't receive a comment, so I was a bit disappointed. <coughs> So please leave a comment on this video and tell me if you like those self-working magic or not so that I don't post more videos if you don't and I will post more videos if you do like them. So really, please, please leave a comment. But anyway, let's get started. So first you shuffle the cards. Well, they, the spectator shuffle the cards doesn't, really doesn't matter. And they, you ask them to pick, to pick a card. So yeah, let's say they pick this one and while they're looking at it by the way it's the eight of diamonds what you're going to do is grab a deck in your other hand for me it's the right hand turn it over you remember the last card four of clubs catch it back with your other hand and when you do it quick it looks natural and not suspicious at all that's the only thing you have to do in this trick memorize the last card which is the four of clubs and so when you're done you take the card back, put it on top of the deck, and say you're going to shuffle. And what you're going to do is go in French shuffle position, grab like um, three quarters of the deck, put them on top. So now the four of clubs and their card, the eight of diamonds, are like together. So when you're done, you just do like this, <laughs> you don't show the cards, and shuffle again, making sure they aren't separated like this, and you continue. And so, and on and on. So it looks natural. And when you're done, you're going to spread the cards. That. And you're going to look for the card you've memorised. So our card is down here. Four of clubs. And you can see that their card is like, um, it's just like next to the four of clubs. So what you're going to do is you're going to say, I'm going to take your hand and your finger is going to guide me through the cards to find yours and you just go you f f so for first you go like all the deck then only half then small 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 until you find on the card and you think wait 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 your hands tell me it's this one and they're going to be like wow how did you do it but the thing is what well, you must be careful do the presentation right because this trick is very famous however the mind reading thing with the finger is not that famous so if you don't do it people will guess your trick but if you do it it will seem like much more impressive so i hope the explanation helped you if it did please like comment and subscribe and i'll see you next time bye